Hi, welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. I'm Joanna and I'm a PSLE Science Specialist here at the Peak Lab. In this video, I'll be analysing a question on seed dispersal. I've also placed this question in a handout and you may download it for free by clicking on the link in the description box below. So let's get started. Farmers always remove unwanted weeds from the vegetables that they grow. And why do you think they do that? Why do they want to remove these unwanted weeds? If the weeds are there, they are competing with the vegetables for... What do plants compete for? I always get my students to remember the four things that plants compete for as... We must share snacks. And what does WMSS stand for? W stands for water. M stands for mineral salts, which is also known as nutrients. S stands for space. And the other S stands for sunlight. Some of you may be wondering, don't plants compete for food? Hmm, let's think about this. Plants, they can make their own food. So do they need to compete for food? No, as long as they receive enough water and sunlight, they are able to make their own food. So they do not compete for food. Do plants compete for air? No, as well. Air is abundant. So they do not need to compete for air. So mainly these are the four things that plants compete for. So knowing that plants compete for these four things, water, mineral, salt, space and sunlight, students, when they answer this question, they are going to choose water, space, sunlight and even nutrients because nutrients refers to mineral salts. So students are going to choose all the four options and they're going to choose number four as their answer. However, number four is wrong because look at this question specifically. If the weeds are there together with the maize plants, yes, they are all going to compete for water which is found underground. They are also going to compete for mineral salts, which is found in the soil underground, together with the water as well. How about space? Yes, they are competing for the space here. Now, how about sunlight? Take a look at this part over here. It says that the unwanted wheat has reached its maximum height. That means this is the maximum that the wheats can grow. Do you think the weeds being there will prevent the maize plant from receiving sunlight? No, because the weeds are too... Yes, they are too short. And since they are too short, they are not actually competing for sunlight with the maize plant. They are too short to even compete for sunlight. So that's the reason why you cannot choose sunlight as your answer. And the only three things that the weeds are competing with the vegetables for are water, space and nutrients, which is also known as mineral salts. That's why the answer for this question is A, B and D, which is number three. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you want to check out the other videos we made, click on the links on the right hand side. Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you next time. Bye!